Hello there, you guys. How are you all doing today? Mike is cross-eyed literally in the background. How are you guys all doing? I hope everyone is having a good day. Um, apologies if I'm a little bit just down today. I have a bit of a headache still and I'm just not really feeling that great and I have a nasty feeling I'm coming down with something, so that's fantastic. But I have my coke, so I'm good. <laughs> Also, Mike is not currently playing Diablo. I forgot to switch that again. Mm. He's currently playing Breath of the Wild. That's probably what he's going to be playing all stream. <laughs> no, I was playing Switch Nova. Okay, that works then. Mm. Yeah, Mike always tries to make expressions before we go live, I think. Mm. I'm going to go ahead and scroll up and say hello to everyone in chat. I assume audio is just fine. Mm. Hopefully. <laughs> um, Mystical, hello, and Metsuri. You guys have obviously been in here for a while. Um... Dysphoric, I think it's how you pronounce that. Welcome to the stream. I think that's how you say that username. Let me know. <laughs> um, Rider Arrow, hello. Kitty Cat, Fireblaze, Unique Adam, Alicia, uh, Tape It's Rocket Blasters, Mango Face, uh, Tristan, uh, Puglexa, Early Morning Probably, T, welcome back all of you. Rain's World, hello. Sorenzo, hello. Uh, Trent and Rex, hello. Loki, hello. Addy, hello. I think I'm getting to a destroy man. Hello, how are you guys all doing today? Uh, Trenton, Rex, thank you very much for that host. Means a lot. Um, half empty, hello, how are you doing today? Mhip, hello. Uh, let me see. Duddles, hi, how's it going? Toads, Toad Sly, hello. Uh, Platinum, welcome back, how are you doing today? I'm happy you guys are all in here. I know there's some people who couldn't make it for like the weekday, um, yeah, I guess weekday stream, so. It's cool to have everyone back here on on a Saturday. Uh, Celestite, hello. Ligala, hello. How are you doing? Dancing, but you can stay for a bit. I hope you have fun. I hope you have fun when you when you go. Uh, let me see here. Let me see here. I think I got everyone so far. Sleeping Fox, hello. Random, hello. How are you doing today? Pikachu lover, Hannah, hello. Uh, Jerry B, hello. To do McGrojo, welcome back, you guys. Clear, hello. Uh, let's see, Shannon, hello, how you doing? Oh, Shiny Toad at all, very nice, very nice, yeah. Um, I think it just started where we are as well, so. Uh, Dimples, hello, how you doing? Thank you very much for that follow, it's just gonna pop up right there. <laughs> oh boy. Um, who else am I missing here? Uh, Mini MC Witch, hello. Memory's looking great. You're making me want to start yours again. Well, good luck if you do. Um, I know starting over or even just going back into a town you haven't played in a while can be kind of difficult. <laughs> Same time, what do the snowflakes do? I think you catch them and you can give them to the snowman, I believe, and get furniture. I forget how that works. Going to Narnia, hello. GGW, hello. Midge be creeping. Bob was creeping too. I think I saw him earlier. Yeah, Bobby. Bob was summoned by the follower. <laughs> Gamer Ethan, hello. How are you guys all doing today? Hope everyone is having a fantastic weekend. Um, I'm tired. I'm tired and I'm not feeling that fantastic. I have a little bit of a headache that's just not going away. So I've rest from football eight hours ago. <laughs> so would I. I would be uh, out of it too. Uh, Galaxy Gamer, thank you very much for that follow, as well as Natalie, thank you very much for the biddies. Oh yeah, so um, we have all of our villagers in. If you guys haven't been here for the last week, which is totally fine, by the way, like I totally understand. Um, we have all of our villagers, if you go over to this screen and check out our map up there, all my villagers are in the correct places. Um, so let me see here if I know them all off the top of my head. We have Bob Gaston. Cube, Midge, Colton, uh, Kevin, Eric, Blue Bear, BB, and Astrid. Those are our ten villagers, and they're all in. Uh, Angel, I, I already have two copies of the game, and I feel like that's more than enough for me, so I didn't want a new one. And I had no attachment to that town. I wasn't actually playing it, so. Okay, Evie, hello. Um, but yeah, in the last week, I believe... I believe we put in our paths. I don't remember if that was last weekend or if it was during the week, but we put in our paths, so this is done. Um, we've time traveled forward about a week, give or take. We're on the 18th. Um, and that was just making sure everyone moved in correctly, so that's why we're ahead right now. 
No, you'd be creeping all of them. <laughs> 13 shinies, Pokemon Go. Very nice, very nice. Sophia, not at all. We just started. How's it going? Jackie, hello. Welcome to the stream. And you haven't slept. Dimples, please. <laughs> you need sleep. It's kind of important. Happy Meal and Foxy Roxy, hello. How are you both doing today? Um, so yeah, that's about it. We have all of our villagers moved in. We put down paths. Um, we got the police station public works project. We did quite a bit over the week. Um, but it's all up on YouTube if you guys uh, would like to go check it out personally, yourselves. Feel free. Cool Zebra, hello. How are you doing today? Welcome on in here, you guys. One gay for it. Uh, Duddles, I might. I might do it. Um, for maybe tomorrow's stream? I I'm kind of tempted to, but... Boopins, hello. How are you doing today? Uh... I think it's Tire Tracks. That's kind of a cool username. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Diving tricks to get public works projects. I need to unlock the uh, the swimsuit before we can do that. Or purchase it, I guess. You, what are you looking at, buddy? He's just like having a moment with me. <laughs> awesome, hello, welcome back. Drilling big public works project? <laughs> the past search continues. Oh gosh, you have to sound almost more picky than I do. You're, I'm usually the more picky one. Switch Animal Crossing comes out while you're working on this town. Will you switch games and stop working? Yes. Yes, this is my goodbye to New Leaf. And once the Switch comes out, or the Switch game comes out, I'll be switching switching over to that exclusively. Yeah, Matsuri, I'm, I'm looking forward. I'm, I'm thinking maybe... Um, Depending on how long I stick with this weekday schedule, depending on how long it takes me to find another job. Um, maybe having like a set schedule for Mario Kart streams, because those are a lot of fun. Oh, Game Reason, I wish I could help. I'm terrible with town names. I'm terrible at naming things in general. Uh, yes, Mystical, yes. Let me see here. Read purple panties and everything it says orange, orange. Orange and orange makes purple, but it doesn't work. I get orange. How long have you been trying for uh, for the purple ones? Because sometimes it's just a, it's just a luck thing. Uh, Swimming Marlin, hello, welcome back. How are you doing today? Stay up all night and still haven't slept. Oh gosh, kitty cat. What is it? What is it with people staying up all night? You guys, sleep is good. <laughs> Tutor, hello. Pikachu lover, Hannah. I'm, I'm very tired. Have a headache. Not feeling very good. But I'm here. <laughs> Joe, hello. How are you doing? Cube's like, I heard you weren't feeling good. I'm here. <laughs> Look at him. Look at how cute he is. Plus, he's so not at all. Welcome on in here, Padfoot. Hello. I was just waiting for people to join in because I know that there's still people who are just kind of trickling in here. Um, I don't add people really anymore with the friend code. One, because my old friend code list, both of them, both other 3DSs I have are completely filled up. And two, I don't want to fill up this new one. Um, unless I'm actually gonna be like raffling off villagers and I need their friend code, so I'll be adding people as I need to, pretty much. <laughs> Natalie, hello. Jade, hello, welcome back. How are you doing? Sleep is for the week. No, 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 no. Not sleeping is for the week, guys. Sleeping is amazing. He'd be still in the spotlight. That's okay. He deserves it. He's adorable. Okay. All right, McGrojo, that sounds good. You enjoy your lurk. Oh, oh right. I left all my tools on the beach because we went to the island yesterday <laughs> to earn some bells. Uh, plan for today? I don't know. I was gonna ask you guys. What do you guys want to do today? Because I, I still want to do town development and stuff like that, but we've paid off the police station. We have bells for another public works project. And all of our villagers are in the right place, so no more plot resetting, hopefully. <laughs> Oh boy. Linden Bach, hello, how you doing? Welcome back here. Hmm. So, looking around for our usual dailies. Oh, half empty, very nice, very nice. I hope you have a found you found a nice maybe path to use or something like that. Oh gosh, Jade, I probably should have done that before I went live. <laughs> uh I guess not. <laughs> Try to take over the world. I think I think we have our towns mixed up, random. 
Go to the police station and check the campsite. I will do. I will do. Uh, tomorrow is the fishing tournament. It's going to be a fishing frenzy. We should have a huge fish fry when it's over. Maybe I should see if I can sneakily catch a fish ahead of time to win the tourney. <laughs> Wait, didn't I just see Gaston here? There you are, buddy. Jade, I didn't. I was online for a little bit after stream and then I was just. I spent most of the night offline. <laughs> Or you see Tom Nook, will the game not progress long enough to make a path to be able to put in place? You don't go to plant the tree in the town plaza before you see Tom Nook, will the game... You mean, like, with your first character? Because no, it, it won't progress. You have to plant the tree, I think. I think, I think that's what you're asking. I just want to make sure. Uh, Anonymines? I think? That's how you pronounce that? Hello, how are you doing today? What do you think of Marshall? I've had him before, he's okay. He's very popular. I don't- he's not my favorite, but he, he's okay. He's cute. Given M, hello, welcome back as well. Flying Guardians of Breath of the Wild are the worst? Yes. Yes, they are. <laughs> um, what's the latest, Gaston? Hey, hey sweet, see, you any good at catching bugs? You're pretty much the best. Except for one kind. I really want a bagworm, but these puppies are hard to catch. Alright, guys, we're gonna get stung by a bee today. It is confirmed. Because <laughs> we have to do this for Gaston. Huh? Thank you, Jade. I'm so sorry about that. I was just, like, not in... I don't know. I was out, I was out of it last night. Just like I am today. Okay. Oh, hi, what are you doing back here? I forgot we changed her catchphrase to Tweet Tweet. That's cute. Oh, T, thank you very much. One oh, of those babies is about to pop up. There it is. <laughs> Crimson and Alexa, welcome back in here. How are you guys doing? Red Arrow, I was under the impression that would still make the bees come out. Am I wrong? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Kid, right now, at the moment, I don't have enough space for another QR code, so I'm kind of out of luck for that one. What did I do on the island? I just caught bugs to, uh, make money. That's all I did over there. Let me see here. What made me love Bob so much? I don't have a really good backstory. I just... He's just a cool cat, you know? He's purple. I like purple. <laughs> uh... Is it Zoe? I'm not sure how to pronounce the username. I just let me know how to pronounce it. Uh, person who used to be Zozo. <laughs> I don't know how to say that, but let me know. You have an Uchi villager if you get stung. Yes. And we could also, I think, save and quit or save and continue also gets rid of the sting, I believe. Uh, Mayor Imogen, I think it is. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Imogen. I'm not sure how to say the name. Let me know. Let me know. I don't want to butcher it too badly. Worth a try, though, maybe. I could. I could. And Tady, thank you very much for the follow as well. Welcome on in here, you guys. How's it going? I'm happy everyone's been able to make it. Oh, see, sometimes a shovel and a bunch of dirt is all you need to relieve stress. I was literally looking for the money rock, but <laughs> okay. Yeah, we do have an Uchi villager. We have Phoebe. So... Hopefully. Maybe she'll give me medicine. <laughs> yeah, if you shake trees, they're still there. <laughs> yeah. The legal dinosaur, hello, welcome back. Is it worth it to keep time traveling to get a purple pansy? In my opinion, no. I don't time travel for hybrids purely because I'll get them eventually. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm in no rush to get flowers. In terms of like moving in villagers and stuff, it's a little bit different, but... The flower is not, not in my opinion at least. Oh yeah, we bought these things from the campground yesterday. That's cool. If you guys missed yesterday's stream, I, I haven't actually uploaded it to YouTube yet. I've been very slow about that, I'm sorry. Um, we scanned in Captain's amiibo, his amiibo figure. So he came to our campsite and we purchased a couple things from his RV. Okay, let me see here. Sounds good, Jade. Sounds good. S 
Soy soy? Soy soy soy. Zoe, soy. I think I got it, maybe? Let me know. <laughs> oh, very nice, Matsuri. <gasps> Mick Kurd. Mer sorry, Mick. Mr. Kid Keep. I don't know why I have issues with your username. It's nice, but like, I've just, like, my mouth is just not meant for this. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Gus, hello, welcome back. Can't wait for grass again. I'm happy that my trees are green, man. Which, by the way, I think that they turn green on the 16th or 15th if you guys are. Interest in time traveling ahead to get to that point. Let me see here. Uh, is it Sky Moon? Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Cyrus's RV has awesome chairs. Oh, maybe we should scan him in today. Oh, awesome chairs in what way? Are they like good for my theme or are they just good in general? <laughs> You're done with snow? Yeah. I got it right. Awesome. <laughs> Oh, have empty, have fun! Ugh, I hate snow. I hate the cold. Purple tulip, very nice, very nice. RV's coming over to the campsite. Um, I think generally there's only a certain number that will randomly come to your campsite. I don't remember how many there are, but... Ever, I'm doing okay. How about you? Um, Crimson, my go-to things are to talk to the villagers a lot and fish up garbage and sell it or put it- give it to retail, essentially. <laughs> Not sure if they work with the theme. We can see. We can see. Cyrus has the cabin wall. Does he really? Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so the three items that we got yesterday, if you guys weren't here from Captain's RV, was the wood plank table, because I think it fits with cabin. Uh, the model sailor and the model bus, which are just references back to previous games, and I'm a, I'm a softie for that, so. <laughs> yeah, Bella B, welcome on in here. Um, so please ignore my house. It's really, really bad, I know. I have, like, there's no organization. Nothing is where it should be. I'm not even keeping half of these items. It just kind of is a thing at the moment. So if you guys reference or recognize older games... First, Captain kind of ferried you to the island on a little boat like that one in the GameCube version. And that was also on the dash of the car of the taxi he drove you to your town in, in Wild World. And then, of course, for those who played City Folk, you'll recognize the, uh, the bus. Or Let's Go to the City in Europe, I believe it was. <laughs> Housework is killing you? I feel you. I probably need to clean up. Favorite number? 256. <laughs> It's a big number, but it's my favorite. I'm happy you're enjoying the streams. Looks like a Minecraft house. It does a little bit. It does, actually. Um, Alright, let's go head back out then. More refined way to get furniture. Maybe you could request one item a day to be ordered in from the storage room or something along those lines. But you have to have the same type of... Or, but you have to type the name of the piece of furniture in so it's not just like having a complete catalog. And you have to know what you want. Yeah, I could see that. I could see that. Aw, uh, Mr. Commissar, you were having a bad week. That's not cool. How do you get those? Those were from Captain's RV. So I scanned in his amiibo figure yesterday. And I purchased them from his RV using those uh, meow coupons or cat coupons or whatever they're called. <laughs> Tea suitor, wow, you're getting creative. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Okay, so we're just gonna go ahead and look for our daily fossils. Um, reminder, you guys, if you guys see a fossil that I walk by, please let me know because I've been missing one for like the last good couple of days, <laughs> which is kind of embarrassing. Um, I also am expecting to find a pitfall in town today, which is not so fun, but I accidentally stepped on the one that we had yesterday. Don't move here. I swear to God. <laughs> All the noise. Um, the don't move here signs? Yeah. I really like these as well. Oh, hi. Wait, did we talk to Bob already? I don't think we did. I'm gonna talk to him again. If I did. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I don't even have the energy to shake a tree. Would you pick a peach for me? 
Uh, yeah, I got you, bro. It's right there. But if you don't have the energy, I mean, I guess that's a thing. Oh gosh, give me a second, you guys. I think I'm gonna sneeze. Sorry about that. I'm back. I'm good. <laughs> I didn't want to uh, hurt any of your eardrums by sneezing right into the microphone. I also didn't want to sneeze all over my microphone. However, I could. I, what I was thinking of doing is I might just ask people ahead of time on the Animal Crossing Discord, like the section of the Animal Crossing Discord, and be like, hey, could we just all scan in a villager and have people come over and do trades or whatever? Because I think that'd be a nice way to make use of the community. There's a lot of people who want to play together, so... I don't know. That, that was what I was thinking, but I think that sounds good. Uh, Alexis Valve Games? Uh, or Alex is Valve Games. I'm not sure how to say the name, but welcome to the stream. I think it might be Alex? How are you doing today? <laughs> I'm sorry if I missed- if I uh, said your name wrong. And thank you for the blesses. <laughs> and the Gesundheit. Yeah, just what I wanted. That was so tasty. Oh, I should give you something, shouldn't I? Okay, please take my robo closet. Okay, cool. Thanks. Do you have Colton's shirt on? Yes, and I think it's adorable. My eardrums are already terrible anyway, so are mine. Oh, someone- oh, cube! Hey, did you know getting a sandbox- oh! Wow! We're having uh, another public works project suggestion. That's cool. Thank you. I don't really plan on doing a park for a while, but the sandbox could be useful. Uh, link to the Discord was just posted in chat for anyone who's just asking. It's nobody. That's totally fine. I know many people in here had class or work or whatever over the past week, so I'm happy you guys are able to make it to the weekend streams, though. Okay, let's see here. Let's see here. There's a weed over there. That's not cool. Any Animal Crossing Amiibo figures you don't have? I'm missing Celeste, Blathers, and uh, Timmy and Tommy, I believe. And I think those are the only ones I'm actually missing. I think I have all the others. Holy snail, hello. How are you doing today? Uh, isn't it so romantic saying letters across the world to those you love and admire? And when you finally hear back, it's the greatest feeling imaginable. The one in charge of delivering all those vital letters is Pete, the male pelican. Thanks to him, the world is filled with the hope and promise of love. You are such a dreamer and I love it. <laughs> I am Canadian. I am Canadian. I'm from Toronto. What's my schedule? Currently, I stream Monday to thri through Friday, um, starting at 12 p.m. EST, and then Saturday and Sunday at 2 p.m. I'm probably gonna input like a day or two off at some point, but I'm not sure when exactly. And Natalie, thank you very much for the biddy. And someone else asking for the Discord. That's about it. <laughs> Sorry, I just want to make sure I read all that properly. I can put another link to the Discord for people who wanted it. Determined once I get a job to get the Sanrio set. Hello Kitty's my jam, man. <laughs> it is pretty expensive, yeah. Especially if you're if you're trying to get the entire thing, but it might be worth it, especially if you're a big fan, you know. Um, so Kevin and Eric aren't in their houses, which is unfortunate. Baby is there though. Hi! This is her first day walking around. We had so much trouble moving her in. Well well, if it isn't crystal. So, what's up? There's a rumor going around about you, you heard? Everyone's saying Crystal is quite the s- I'll have you know I was making the town pretty. <laughs> I kind of see what they're talking about. No. I don't like that one. I need to plant more trees. <laughs> okay. That's cool. Thanks. Thanks, Phoebe. First day. She's already insulting me. Oh. Rip. <laughs> I love that her catchphrase is peach. I don't think I'm ever gonna let her change it. Because it fits in with our town. Our native fruit is peaches. I've been thinking that my tea set really isn't a good touch for this room. 
Once they replace replaced it, anything that fits that spot is a million times more awesome. I bet you find that perfect accent for me. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, okay, so your tea set is something that goes on something. I don't have anything like that right now. Oh, uh, okay, let me see if I can pronounce this username. Is it Juseng? May have butchered it. Welcome to the stream, first off. Second off, let me know if that's how I should say your name. And to anyone else in here, I will try and try and remember if you let me know. No pressure though, if you just feel like lurking, that's totally cool as well. Shifting your house around that she gives you cheek. Unbelievable. She's she's kind of cheeky. That is actually the correct term for her, I think. Okay, let's see here. Um I'm really hoping that we get the cafe soon, because if you guys don't know, uh, we're gonna end up putting it probably in this little area here. It would fit perfectly, it'd be really even in center, so... Um, but we haven't had that suggestion yet, so... I think we need to complete the second floor of the museum first. Could be wrong. Sluggish log and high heel prints, hello! Oh, G, you sang. Okay, I will try and remember that. Please keep telling me if I keep getting it wrong. I'm so sorry. I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling a little bit headachy, a little bit achy in general, maybe coming down with something. So I'm sorry if I'm a little bit not as uh, up as I usually am. <laughs> yep, Dev, I'm waiting to see if anyone's gonna ask to move because I've heard rumors that if you have all amiibo villagers scanned in, like 10, like I do, then their chances to move out return to normal, if that makes sense. So I'm waiting to see what they're gonna do. I'm swimming, thank you very much for that host. You need the museum gift shop? Okay, so we've already unlocked that, it's just we haven't actually started building or paying for it. Um, I also, fun fact, you guys got a notification from Isaac Bell before I went live that um, the uh, the venue, Club LOL on Main Street, is done, so we can check that out today too. I'm very much looking forward to Animal Crossing on the Switch. Yeah, I, I think it's going to be really good. I'm, I have faith in Nintendo. <laughs> okay, nothing here. Thing here. We've only found one fossil so far and I'm a little bit concerned. <laughs> uh, lots of melted- Merman, that sounds amazing. First off, melted cheese. I'm down for that. <laughs> we only just started. We only just started, so we're just going around town doing dailies, catching up. Also, I found that pitfall, so I'm gonna go put that back down on the beach and hopefully not step on it again, because <laughs> that was really, really silly. Yep, Tanner, we have Blue Bear. She is a cutie and we very much are attached to her. <laughs> Happens more often if you're missing one of the villager types, if not, your chances are lower than normal. Maybe I should start kicking those up then, because we don't need to- hopefully we're not going to need to plot reset anyone else. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and put this back here. If you guys don't know what I'm doing, um... Pretty much, if you can dig up a pitfall and like not stand it and actually dig it up, uh, you can move it somewhere like on the beach or somewhere you wouldn't normally walk, and no other pitfalls will spawn in your town over the next however long, you know, however long it stays buried there, so. Pitfall telling your villagers, very nice, very nice. Simply for dirt, pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> uh, it's pretty, um, I'm not even sure. Oh, it was, um, I believe there was a charity thing that Twitch was doing, so if you donated bits, I believe, and you put hashtag charity, I think those people got these snowflakes, at least that's what I think that means. <laughs> that's what I did. <laughs> that's how I figured that out, hon. I tried. <laughs> Sometimes I have strokes of genius. Most of the time, not. Uh, notice, tomorrow's the fishing tourney. Try to catch the biggest one out there. Who will win the trophy? Probably Bob. Just saying. He's a cat. He's good at this. <laughs> Lasan, hello. How are you doing today? Oh, illegal dinosaur for sure. Let me hear. Simsy Puff, hello. How are you doing? Um, still a little bit headachey, not gonna lie. Um, maybe coming down with something. But, uh,. Still here, still gonna stream for you guys. Just 
3DS recently broke and I tried screwing the back off, but I got a strip screw. Oh, literally. That sucks. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully, you know, we get Animal Crossing on the Switch soon. I don't know if you have one of those, but, you know, hopefully we're all able to move on to that game. And if you don't have a 3DS, it'll be fine. <laughs> Uh, just saying, what you could always do is glue the tip of something, like, I don't know, a uh, paper clip or something, to that screw. Take that screw out and you can always replace it. Yeah, Mike is better at that kind of stuff than I am. It's all whether or not you feel comfortable attempting it, of course. Yeah, or you can get a flathead, considering it seems like that screw. Ooh. That screw is very malleable. Um, you can take a flathead screwdriver and kind of try to press it into it so it makes like a ridge, and you'll be able to get some grip on it. It has to be able to, like just fit into that hole. Tape it, I am. I am indeed. Yeah. Someone played Population Grind on GameCube. She had Blue Bear in her town. I guess there was a glitch one day because she literally got stuck in a tree. Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. I would love to see that. The funniest thing I've had happen with a villager glitching out is, and this was in, mm, I don't know if this is in Rosewood or not. Um, I had, I believe it was Kabuki. I had Kabuki and I put a wind turbine kind of in this upper left-hand corner of town. And you see how there's this cliff up here? So we had the, the ceremony, the completion ceremony, and when it was done, I had three villagers around me, and Kabuki was nowhere to be seen. I'm like, okay, that's kind of weird. Where did he go? And then my camera panned up just like that, and he's standing up on top of that cliff. And I'm like, you're not meant to- was it Kabuki? Pretty sure it was Kabuki. I think he was a white- oh, maybe it was- it wasn't Portia. Pretty sure it was Kabuki. I have a picture of it somewhere. I saved- my older picture, so I'm gonna have to find it because it was really funny. But uh, when I changed, like when I went out to Main Street and came back, he was back on the round, so. Lizzie, madame, no worries, we only just started. But yeah, Kabuki, Kabuki was cool. I'm pretty sure it was him. I'm second guessing myself now, but I'm pretty sure it was Kabuki. But yeah, it's pretty funny. <laughs> uh, once again, I'll be waiting probably a year or two to get the next version. Story of my life, I almost always got the next Animal Crossing game years later. Do you not have the console? I mean, you know, if it's if it's if it's a uh, pattern up until now, maybe there's a good reason why. <laughs> maybe there's gonna be some really bad thing with Animal Crossing at first, and they need to patch it. It is Gus. It is for sure. Um. Okay. Just let me know, you guys, if you see a fossil. I'm still missing one after like days. It's kind of silly. Nearly was going to fish and Marshall just casually walking in the ocean. <laughs> See, it's really funny when New Leaf or when Nintendo games in general glitch because Nintendo does a generally very, very good job on making sure that their games are very solid. And generally, generally. And it's just, it's amusing to me when something goes wrong. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm not gonna get all of these. Oh, I did! Wow! Yay! Money. Kitty cat, I can see that. I can see that. That's half the reason why I like him now. He's kind of weird looking, but you're right, he does actually have a have a similarity. His face was stuck? I do. I Grandmax, I have those pictures as well. That was really funny. Bob's face got stuck in a weird position after Ark talked to him when he was visiting my old town. And it was just the funniest thing. <laughs> See, see, it's not much. We only just started. We're just talking, catching up, seeing how people are doing, letting people know what we did. Also, police station. Um, so I know this looks bad. If you guys don't know, I can't actually put a path here. Um, it'll automatically put it down. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna have maybe some bushes here. I don't know. I don't know if I can actually do that now. Can I have bushes in these spaces here? Because it's literally right, like, there's no space between the bushes and the well. Does anyone know if that's still gonna work, or am I gonna have to move that well? 
pretty much is my question. Desa, hello, how are you doing today? Money. <laughs> oh gosh, I, I can't see him doing it, but I wouldn't I wouldn't be that upset. Like, yeah, it would suck, but like it's a thing. I I, I still like Animal Crossing. <laughs> Oh, is it sea bass only? Okay, that's cool. I can catch some today. Bushes can't touch bubble works. Bushes. Gosh darn it. Okay, we gotta move that well. Um, maybe? Maybe I can make it work if I... No, I still can't do it. Because there at least needs to be one here and... Oh! No way. No, 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 no. Come here. No, no. Come here. Come here. Mole That's the mole cricket. I always have trouble catching that. There's no way I just randomly dug it up. You got it. Yes. You should donate it. I'm don't, donating don't it. Eat it. I'm not gonna eat it. <laughs> I got so lucky. What is that? Wow. I'm happy now. This is a good day. This is a good day. Even though I'm dropping frames like. Like they're hot potatoes right now. Jeez. Is anyone noticing any really major frame drops? I'm guessing you guys are, but let me know. Yup, Dev, I wasn't even gonna try and catch it, because I always end up digging up like half my town trying to get it. Go and donate right away. I will, I will. Just I just I have one more section just to check out before we uh go to the museum. Just I wanna make sure I don't miss this last fossil, you guys. Which I already have, I know, but like I seriously don't know where it is. Why is the mole- it's not really rare, it's just the fact that most people, like, you know, by the time they get to winter or, um, you know, they already have flowers and stuff down and you have to dig the mole cricket out of the ground, so it's really annoying to get. <laughs> Eat it, please. <laughs> yep, Amprio, Mike is back. He was back since yesterday. Kevin, hello. None here? Not noticed any drop seats. Seeing I've dropped 30% of my frames, so I think you guys would have noticed. It's weird. It's weird. I've dropped literally 30% and I've been live for 40 minutes, so. Jeez. Um, what's the latest? I don't know what you're gonna buy, but don't spend too much of your allowance. What allowance? Man, I make my monies. I hit a rock and it spits money at me. Well, Game Reason, thank you. Behind retail, behind the police station, I had a font. I checked behind retail and the police station, but I'll check behind town hall again just to make sure. Into World War One trenches trying to find the mole. Exactly, exactly. So I was just planning on skipping it. <laughs> no worries, Dasa. Good luck with everything. Hope it's all going well. I see, like, I don't know where this last fossil is. Seriously. I need Ark to come over and find it for me. He's the best at finding them. I think so, Natalie. It could be wrong. Uh, cereal before milk. If you do it the other way, I don't understand. You're just gonna have soggy cereal on the bottom. Like, what is that? <laughs> Thank you, Dazza. We'll see ya. Allowance, you're the mayor. <laughs> Sorry, playing pocket camp again? Yeah, I've started playing it as well. A little bit. Like, I'm not, like, dedicated, but I am playing it every day. So maybe that is dedicated. I don't know. Okay, so let's assess the fossils that we got first. I used to be uh, not really a breakfast person. I used to feel sick in the mornings if I ate breakfast, but then I started working. And I just, like, I can't get through the day without food before 12, I guess. So I was just like, oh, I better start stuffing my face first thing. Pretty much. <laughs> A legal dinosaur? What do you- what do you mean? We already have the fountain there, but if you have another thing in mind... Does it even exist? I don't- I don't know, man. I don't know. Favorite KK Slider song? Um... I think it's either KK Disco or Disco KK. I forget which way it goes. But the Disco one. It's cute. Okay, so that's all we got. Hmm? 
Danico, hello, how are you doing today? Nicole, hello. Uh, watching streams is always the highlight of my day, so it's okay. Well, I hope you feel better soon. I think I'm coming down with a cold as well, so we could just have like a sick stream. <laughs> Natalie, mm. thank you very much for the biddy. I put milk and then sir <gasps> Natalie, no! <laughs> what, have you ever tried it the other way? Or have you always just done it that way? No worries, I'm here. I'll see ya. Oh, kitty cat, those are two very different songs. <laughs> okay, let's see here. What have we got? Nothing I really want. I don't know if I like the current door we have right now, but I don't know if I like that one either. <laughs> Won't there be a milk splash? I don't I just- I feel like you're just gonna have dry cereal on top and then super soggy cereal on the bottom. What happens? If you put milk and then cereal on top of your milk. It's gonna have soggy cereal on the bottom. I just- Cause you I eat from the top and then it's even and then- I just <laughs> eat- I just pour the milk on top of my- Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. But I like drinking the milk so I like it tasting like- <laughs> Natalie, maybe try the other way one time. Just maybe next time you there think about it. There are bowls you can get that have the milk and cereal separate and you can scoop And you can together. scoop it, yeah, to keep them if you really don't like soggy. Cereal and milk and spontaneous combustion. Random, just because you set fire to the kitchen whenever you make cereal. Fire to the kitchen whenever. Water, boiling water too, or just pouring a glass of water probably. Yep, Deb. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, I'm- if I have cereal, I'm more likely to eat it dry, personally, as well. Buckins, I agree with you. Uh, Alex, no. Uh, my boyfriend does. I'm not really interested in fighting games, to, on, on the whole. <laughs> Allie, hello. Smash. He got the game. He likes it. <laughs> Uh, a tiny little cat. We're currently time traveled forward about a week, but it was just to get villagers to move in. We haven't really done too much yet. Brazil's nasty. I mean, I don't like cinnamon toast crunch with milk. That's just weird, personally. But like, I need that Cheerios all eat with milk. Maybe. <laughs> it depends on how I'm feeling. Oh, the little nugget. Very nice. Very nice. All right, let's see if we can find who owns this book, you guys. I want to hear another one of those silly mole crickets. Oh, Black Lux is very nice. Also, I didn't check on my blue rose today. Thank you very much for reminding me of that. I'll go check on that right now. Andrew, hello. Favorite type of cereal? Um... I don't know. I don't know anymore. I don't really eat cereal very often, that's the thing. I would assume you're... I don't know if it's either anymore. Sour Patch Kids cereal? That just sounds wrong. I don't like Sour Patch Kids in the first place. Also, Tady, thank you very much for those biddies, as well as Crimson. Thank you very much for the both of you. No blue rose. Cool. <laughs> Oh, whoops, I kind of watered the center there. Good job. Needs better water. What am I most excited for about Kingdom Hearts 3? Just the fact that I've been waiting for it forever and it's finally coming out. I don't really have something very specific I'm excited for. I'm very much cautiously optimistic. I'm not trying to get too worked up, even though I am worked up. Okay. Um. I saw a cube up here somewhere, but I didn't see him when I was- Oh, there he is! Found him! Um, did you drop this? Is this yours, buddy? Sorry, this isn't mine. But with Detective Sweet C hot in the case, I'm sure the odor will be found before too long. Thank you. <laughs> No worries, Crimson, at all. Like, that's totally very, very generous of you. I honestly don't expect anything, so. Emma, hello, welcome back. Yeah, Breezy, we can stream. They're usually a bit more. Oh, wait. 
Where am I putting yellow now? I don't even know where I'm putting yellow ones. <gasps> Gaston's house. We haven't put flowers around our villagers' houses yet, you guys. Speaking of Gaston. <laughs> For Donald not healing you? Yes. I get to yell at him some more. A tiny little cat. We actually have all ten villagers moved in. Um, so you can eat just a second here. Oh. Okay, he's gonna change my cat- or uh, my nickname. I'm kinda scared. What do you got, dude? Kid? That's fine. That'll do. Um, but yeah, our ten villagers, if you guys haven't, uh, seen the previous streams or anything like that, which is totally fine. We have Bob, Gaston, Midge, um, Cube, Colton, Kevin, Eric, Blue Bear, Astrid, and Phoebe. Those are our ten. <laughs> Uh, Puglexa, I'm gonna try getting it on my own, but thank you very much. I'm- I'm- I'm kind of aiming for it right now. We'll see, though. We'll see. Okay, so here's some yellows. For around Gaston's house. There's also a really random red one here. The one town I didn't want it in? Oh, that's really annoying. That is actually very annoying, jeez. <laughs> no one calls Crystal a kid like Gaston. I mean, technically, he's a really old man, so I guess he has some right to. I don't mind, it makes sense to the Crankies to call you that, I think? Yeah, exactly, exactly. So we're gonna put some red ones around her house. I think maybe red and white for her, or red and yellow. Because her ha Phoebe's house is red and white, but she is red and yellow. What colors do you think we should put around her house, you guys? I know red. Like, that's, that's an obvious, but I don't know what other colors would work, if that makes sense. And Grace, hello, how you doing today? Alright, let's see if this is hers also. I keep forgetting I'm trying to find the owner of this. Red and yellow, red and yellow, okay. We'll do red and yellow. Uh, did you lose this? Is this yours? Gold roses actually look really good, but that's effort. I don't even know if I'm gonna try for gold roses in this town. It's so annoying to get. <laughs> oh, Pug Lesso, I'm terrible at thinking of names and catchphrases and greetings and all that jazz, but maybe someone else in chat can help out. Oh, where did he go? Oh, oh. They were, I wanted to, no, I wanted to know what you guys were talking about. Midge, how are you doing? Okay, is this yours? This is the book I lost. I thought it was gone for- Okay, that makes sense. She's a normal villager. I think she likes reading generally. Or maybe that's just Goldie. I was borrowing it from a friend, so I'm really glad I get to return it. Thank you so much for returning it. In fact, I'd like to give you a reward. It's not much, but how about a blue check shirt? Okay, I will take it. Red orange would be nice. Yeah, I think maybe a mix of red, orange, and yellow, maybe? I want to be really fancy. I just- I guess I'm talking to him again. What's the latest, dude? <laughs> what do you think of my house? Doesn't it look great from every single angle? Of course, the interior is nice, but I also put a lot of effort into the exterior design as well. I think your exterior looks a lot better than the interior, buddy. A lot better. <laughs> Uh, Art, thank you very much for those biddies. Also, I don't know if I saw that pop up, but thank you so very much. No, go back. Where are my cats? Uh, they're not in the room right now. They're not in the room right now. They tend to get very uh, excited when I start talking in my like streaming voice. In other words, when I start talking, because I'm generally pretty quiet. <laughs> so they think I'm talking to them, and they all come running at me. So. Um, no, this is not how this is meant to go. I think I might start watering the lilies, just for now. I think I may put a hold on our Blue Rose project until we have Perfect Town and we have a Jacob's Lauer to put down there, because apparently it does help. Um, so I guess we'll just start working on these, um, because having some lilies would also be really nice. Oh, good luck, Fireblaze. Good luck. It's a pile of boxes. That's work for Gaston. 
Yeah, I don't like his music either, I'm not gonna lie. It's uh it's a little bit creepy. <laughs> just just a little bit. Yeah, fertilizer, but I don't think we're gonna get that for a while. We need to have uh the uh Leafs Garden Shop upgrade, I believe. And that's not happening for a long time, so <laughs> I'm just gonna hold out for the uh Jacob's ladder. Oh, where's Pugluxa? Or the burn light owl. Oh, that would be really weird. Uh, maybe if you couldn't use those ones at the same time. Ah, <laughs> oh, Cece, no. Just don't poison yourself. That's not a good idea. Maybe, you know what we could do? For Phoebe's house, maybe I could put all reds around here. Like, all around her house. And then the next layer out could be orange. And then maybe the third layer out could be yellow. And then that would blend in. Oh, it wouldn't really blend in with her house, would it? That's disappointing. Oh well. Should I get rid of these don't move here, so you guys? Is that a thing we should do today? I could, I could probably do it off stream because it's gonna get really annoying really quick, but like. Maybe I'll do it just for around Phoebe's house so I can put these reds here. How do you get perfect fruit? So all towns start off with one tree with, I think, one perfect fruit on it. If you can't find that tree, if you ate it by accident, or if um, you put your house on top of it like I did one time, um, I think you have a random chance to get one when you plant trees, or when you shake fruit off trees and then it grows back. I think there's a chance that you'll get your native fruit again, or native perfect fruit. Yeah, Astrid is next to Phoebe. I'm gonna go ahead and put these here. Oh, cat, no! <laughs> I'm really not a Dr. Pepper person. It's... Ugh. It's like just such a strange taste that can't be good for you. I mean, Coke is probably the same, but like, still. Okay, we'll put these two down here and then any other reds will... I guess put them in this area as well. Astrid's area is unique. Astrid herself is unique. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Did I have more reds over here? I did. Lucky day. I also have to figure out what I'm doing with these black roses because we keep getting them from trying to get the, the blue rose <laughs> and I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Because you like real sugar? Yeah, I tried that when I was in Mexico over the summer and it was, it was pretty different tasting. It's kind of cool. Okay, I'm just gonna put these here. Is that actually enough to fill the space? I think it is. Oh, that's actually perfect. That's really nice. Yeah, you. Cool. Alright, Phoebe, now you are not allowed to move. Please and thank you. Sips Dr. Pepper. Guys, come on! <laughs> Be good to yourselves. Black roses around Gaston's house. That could work. That could work. UK Coke is real sugar, right? I have no clue. I have no clue. I know here's... Here's? Here. Ours doesn't. It's a very noticeable taste difference. Mexico. That is fantastic. Black and white flowers around the police station. I usually... I think I had either red and white or red and blue. I kind of like, maybe black and white would be cool though. But it's right at the entrance of town, so I don't know if that's kind of dreary looking. I could do it for now though, because I do need to fill in that space a little bit. See, I was, I was already getting ready with the red and white. <laughs> um, I'm just going to put these three black roses back here. I'm not trying to hide them. I'm trying to make sure that no fossils spawn back here without me knowing. <laughs> um, and I guess I'll just move these for now. Sips on Mountain Dew? Heck yeah. <laughs> that can't be good for you. <laughs> Finn, hello. Because the damn sugar tax, I have to import American vanilla now? For a long time, we didn't have vanilla Coke here either, and then they brought it back a couple of years ago. It's probably because of vanilla. Oh, was it really? Yeah. I didn't even know. <laughs> yeah, natural vanilla is stupid expensive right now. 
because all the uh, places that can actually naturally grow have been having horrible things. Oh. Oh, he wants my blue check shirt. Okay, you can have that. This has been random knowledge about Michael. <laughs> Would you ever consider selling your blue check shirt to me? Oh. <laughs> I would open the window, but I don't want to. Yeah, it'll, it'll freeze. Uh, Tudor, I think people were saying like mid February or early March, I believe. Oh, cherry. I don't like ch most cherry flavored things, which is why I'm not a fan of Dr. Pepper, because there is cherry in that. Cherry vanilla coke, Yes, Crystal Pepsi was a thing. You were, you know, I can't remember. Um, Bob, why? Well, I swear to God, I found like so many different villagers creeping around Gastos. Are you guys talking again? Midge, what do people say about me? Hmm, well, Isabel said she thought you were quite childlike and cute, and I agreed. What? You think of me like a little kid? But that's not fair. And he starts crying. <laughs> I've been drinking three cups of coffee every night before bed so everyone will see how mature I am. That sounds like a good way to not sleep. <laughs> I haven't slept well in weeks. I I had no idea you were trying so hard. I'm sorry if I underestimated you. Well, if you really are sorry, you should dance the I'm sorry dance. Do I have to? Very well. I'm so sorry. <laughs> That's fantastic. I was just saying, Mike knows a lot of random useless facts. He does. He does. <laughs> right. Iron Brew. Wasn't that that... Yep. You guys were on the fence. Everyone was like either divided on that, whether they loved it or hated it a while ago. Mm. Cinnamon Coke? That sounds weird. Mm. That sounds weird. I have not. <laughs> oh, sweet sea. What? Oh no, Crystal. How long have you been standing there? I saw the whole thing. <laughs> oh no, how embarrassing. Crystal, could you please just forget you ever saw that, please? <gasps> oh no, no, that's not what I want. Oh, oh, I feel like such a bad person. Bob, why did you do that? Get that watering. Oh, actually, that's fine. You can water flowers. I'm so sorry. Gaston, please. Now is not the time with the shovel. <laughs> oh, now she's hiding behind the tree. <sighs> I've been a bad person. <laughs> Why do you make her feel bad? <laughs> Bob does look very smug. <laughs> he knows what he did. <laughs> Why are you shoving Gat- Why is Bob being so weird? Oh. Oh my god, I can't. I can't. I'm leaving. <laughs> I think Bob wants to. No, Bob does not want to move out. <laughs> Do the I'm sorry dance. <laughs> All of your flavored cokes are zero, really? That's different. I'm sorry, Pepper. I got away from it. I realized it was probably pretty loud. <laughs> I should, Duddles. I also need to send letters to Bob, so maybe we could do that in a little bit. I need your guys' help with that, though, because I'm not good at writing letters. I was already in here, gosh darn it, what am I doing? I was like, I need to go shopping. I've already been in here. Good job, Crystal. <laughs> Is the spirit of Moose still haunting your town? That wouldn't surprise me. I'm surprised we haven't actually seen him on Main Street yet. Saying they're all sleep deprived. <laughs> Let's see here. Did we get lucky with our cabin thing? Oh! <gasps> we did! Cool! This is mine now, thank you. It's awesome. Yeah, our house is gonna look a little bit better. <laughs> and that's not cabin rock, but that's fine. Yeah, Flautista, I only found three as well again. <laughs> you like cool, shop at the museum. <laughs> Uh, we've been streaming for just over an hour. Just over an hour now. Or you mean in general. I'm never sure when people ask. 
Timing. <laughs> um, yellow tulip, I'll take this. I'm not gonna use it, but I'll buy it from you. Please give me that watering can. And sees Moose with an axe in his hand. <laughs> nope, side of life. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Bless you. I'm gonna laugh so hard if someone just sneezed while watching the stream and I said bless you at the perfect time. That would be hilarious. <laughs> Blesses. <laughs> Do you think it's about time- no. No, I do not, Eric. I love you, but no. I do not need to take a break. Uh, what can I help you with this time? What sort of clothes are you buying today? I'm in the market for some clothes for winter. Yeah. I'm not. I'm pretty- I, I, have, a, I have a sweater on, I have a hat. I'm pretty comfy. Thank you. <laughs> Man, they still don't have my glasses. I mean, I guess that's fine, but like... I kind of need them. I need to see. <laughs> I've been walking around blind this entire time. Oh, don't you hate that when you're about to sneeze and it just stops? <laughs> also, we haven't seen... Um, we haven't seen Astrid today. I think she's the only one I haven't spoken to, so I'm gonna see if we can find her here. Go back into the clothes. Okay. I'm curious why. <laughs> Baby po- Oh, my Grojo, I feel your pain. I am concerned. Why am I going back to the clothes section? I've seen something I liked. What did you- What did you like? What did you like? What about Kevin? We just spoke to him um, a little bit earlier. He's he's on the main street area right now. Is it this one? Is it the skirt? What is it? He sneezes silently and everyone thinks it's real weird. My mom sneezes super, super loud. <laughs> uh, Finn, I don't. I don't. I think if you scroll down below the stream, if you're on PC, you should be able to see most of the commands I have active. Some of them are secret. Oh, you thought it was a shirt? Do you not want it if it's a skirt? I'm assuming you don't want it. I will come back if you do, though. Oh, it was a plaid shirt. Yeah, yeah. Fortunately not. Okay, back on the hunt. Yeah, we spoke to we spoke to Kevin here, which he's hanging out with these three again, and they were all hanging out on Main Street yesterday, and I don't know what's going on, but <laughs> Don't do skirts, same. Same. <laughs> Leon, hello. Uh and nothing was here. Yeah, Leon, I stream at 2 p.m. on weekends and 12 p.m. on weekdays. That's how I've set up the schedule. If you ever aren't sure, by the way, once again, scroll down below the screen, uh, stream. I have a, uh, it looks like a little rectangle. It has my, my icon in it and it has all the times that I stream. It's a schedule thing. I live in flannels. <laughs> okay. Guys, let's see if we can find Astrid and hopefully not cool shopping through our dinosaurs again. Okay, so far so good. I don't know why Cole was trying to shop in here, you guys. A little bit ridiculous. Um, no, don't hear anyone in here. Usually I can hear the villagers before I see them. Like, grandmother, like, mother? It's, it, it's confusing, you guys. You're, the whole age thing is really confusing. <laughs> I 
brought to January 2018. Oh yeah, this is nearly a year ago. Thanks. Thanks for hanging around that long. Sheeposaurus. Oh my god, early morning. That is a random worthy bun. But there you are. That awful, awful shirt. This place is still pretty disappointing to visit. Thanks. <laughs> It's getting better, but we still need help from more people like you. Why don't you help me? Why do the villagers not help? <laughs> yeah, actually, Cupcake Crosser, if you're if ever if ever anyone in chat is curious, exclamation mark uptime in chat, and I, it'll give you the exact time. That's totally cool. No worries, Sophia. How are you doing today? Yeah, Crimson, that sticker book I think did come out from what I saw of people on Twitter. There you go, there's the uptime. Um, also, we unlocked Club LOL today. I don't know if it's already open. It is. Cool. Make sure for everyone, let the madness begin. Hopefully it doesn't spread. Hopefully. Hey, friend. Come on now, you can't come in while I'm in the middle of clean it. Oh, Miss Mayor, it's just you. Thanks for all the help you gave me. Thanks to you, I was able to open up my very own live venue. I'm getting things set up at the moment, but we have some sort of music... Uh, event going on every night. Starting at 8pm tonight, we'll be mixing your favorite hits all night long during our DJ party time. More importantly, what do you think of the place? Isn't the stage amazing? I was actually pretty picky about how I want it to be. I spent a lot of money on it just to get the way I like it. It's really an amazing place, huh? Uh, would have been nicer to perform on a stage like the one in here just once. You might not know this about me, but a long time ago I used to get up and perform on stage too. When I was a musician, though, I was a comedian. <laughs> I tried a while back, but even now, when I see a stage, I can feel it just calling to me. Drunk, it says. <laughs> so that's why every, uh, or why even now I sometimes get the urge to share my old jokes with people. If you're interested, I wouldn't mind showing you my stuff during the afternoons when no one's here. I couldn't ask you to pay me, but I wouldn't turn down a nice treat. Any food pretty much works on me. So, that's how we'll do this then. Feel free to stop by anytime. Sounds good. Meat shirt versus grape shirt. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> Shrunk you suck. <laughs> no, Shrunk is a cutie. He's trying his best. I'm gonna go get something for him to eat. And then we're gonna get our very first emotion, you guys. I'm excited. First step on our way to the Shrunk Shuffle. <laughs> Any food works on me, that's pretty much me. That would be me if I wasn't allergic to most things. Um, I'll take a cherry. Yeah, Kevin's, Kevin has all the uh, all the ladies around him right now. Uh, Ali, yeah, sometimes it's a little bit slow notifying people. Just a little bit. Pet peeves? Um... If you invite someone over your t to your town and they start running, like, not this walking, I mean like running, running, you're gonna trample on my flowers, please don't. <laughs> Pretty much the main thing. Wait, are you guys saying Shrunk has a mustache? I, I thought that was his. N no. No, 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 no. Come up here. Come up here. I need to see your face while I'm talking to you. I can't tell if that's his nose or mustache. Mm. I can see it both ways. Guys, I don't like that. Do I have- I don't have his amiibo. There isn't a shrunk amiibo, is there? No, 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 no. No, no, no. I need to- <laughs> Give me a second. I'm googling his picture here. Shrunk. There's no way. Oh no! <laughs> Why does he have a mustache? It's a mustache? Does that really look like a nose to you? Well, he's supposed to be in a, what a, I... an ax axolotl? Yeah, so that could be just his... Look! What is that? 
Why would they do that? <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. This is not good. This is like when we figured out that Leaf has is the only character who has fingers or claws. Little loser kid, thank you very much for that follow. Welcome to the stream. I can't unsee it. <laughs> oh gosh, guys, I don't like this. I, I brought you a snack. Does he ever mention having a mustache in his dialogue? I don't like this. It's Ginger Tash for sure. I always thought it was a nose. A cherry, don't mind if I do. And unsee, I don't like this. Yeah, apparently, apparently Leaf is the only Animal Crossing character who has proper fingers because all of them have like these little like fists or stubs. <laughs> Pretty much, but he has like claws because he's he's a, um, a sloth, right? But it makes me really uncomfortable to look at. <laughs> it's weird. Uh, Bray boy, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Makes me shook to the core. Isn't that weird? Uh, resignation, resignation joke, okay. The other day, I ran to an old buddy of mine. He used to say, this company isn't grand enough for a man like me. Sometimes I'll show them and quit. Well, you know what I said to him? Could I just get fries with that? I don't know if that's funny or not. <laughs> yeah, I know, the amount of people who think Leaf is a girl. I had someone argue with me in the comments on one of my videos because I called him a boy. And I just sent them the link to the wiki. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce this name. Deketh? Deseth? I'm not sure how to say the name. Welcome to the stream. Thank you very much for that follow. It's about to pop up. Give it a second. There it is. Thank you so very much. Let me know how to say that username. Welcome on in here. It makes a short story with a punchline to create a reaction joke. I retired a while back, but I think my jokes are still relevant, so I'd love for you to try them out too. Oh, I'll give you something else too. You really love this. Ah. <laughs> uh, this is a world famous joke book. You should always keep it close and use it to record the jokes I tell you. Plus, you can. Okay, yes. Tutorials. So now we can do the emotion things. We don't look very pleased about it, but I promise we can. <laughs> It was funny. <laughs> oh, Finn, very nice. Have you played the other? Have you played the other ones, or are you just starting out with the with that one? Also, we should probably put that in our house before I accidentally sell it. <laughs> the scythe. Okay, I will try and remember. If I forget, just let me know again. I'm sorry. I try and remember people's names. <laughs> Keyword try. Not always the best at it, but how do they scratch? I don't. I don't know, man. You get to clip the villager rolling on ground. <laughs> okay, so we got the cabin wall, which is fantastic. We hadn't actually gotten any cabin like flooring or wallpaper yet, so that's good. <laughs> All right, up there for sure. Have a fantastic one. We will see you later. Okay, please ignore the the house. I'm sorry. I'm looking forward to the day that I can walk in here and people aren't gonna be like, what did you do? Oh, we can take this to Cyrus now. Oh, we have Cyrus now. We have so many things to do suddenly. Um, so I'm gonna sell all of these. And I'll bring this to Cyrus. Okay, Finn. I, I just I just wanted to warn you if you hadn't played the other ones, just because if you start off with the one on the DS, you're probably not gonna get very much of the story. It's probably gonna be a little bit confusing. Just wanted to let you know ahead of time. Uh, Lone Paul. I could be wrong on how that's pronounced. Are you guys just staring at me? <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Probably butchered that username, but let me know.
Okay. So, big yawns from Mike in the background. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and sell off this stuff. Um, if you guys aren't aware, I always try and tell people why I purchased all these flowers and the, and the sapling and then I'm not using it. It's because I'm trying to unlock the items that Shrunk will give you if you buy a certain amount of stuff, so that's pretty much why I'm doing that. No one stares like Gaston. Okay, what can you do to this? Can you make this a darker color? I forget what colors there are for this one. No worries, Pepper. Project, you say? I'll be the judge of that. Let me see if you got anything. Hun, could you do me a favor? Could you grab that amiibo? I want to see Cyrus. Got something good. Can I take a closer look? Thank you. Oh, Natalie, better find your charger. Not shrunk. Um, leaf. Did I say leaf? Did I say shrunk? You did say shrunk. I just said shrunk. Shrunk and his golden axes. <laughs> I was confused because shrunk does this. He doesn't. No, he gives you emotions. I was thinking of the garden shop. And I was thinking of shrunk still. Can we change this to a darker color? Blue, beige, or black? I might change it to the black one, maybe? I don't know how good that's gonna look in our cabin home, but... No worries, Broken Toast. Enjoy Minecraft. It's a fun game. Thank you very much for the host, and Natalie, thank you very much for the bit also. I just saw that come through. I think black. I'm gonna try black at least. We'll see how it, how it goes. Because we're going for like a cabin furniture, cabin home sort of thing, but beige is too light to fit in there. Pink obviously doesn't fit. Leaf with a must. What are you guys thinking of? Get out. Can I have this? I want this. I kind of use this as like my game shelf. Because it semi looks like one. <laughs> I think black will look nice. I hope so. I hope so. Um, okay, so we got that. Let's go ahead and put that in our house. Snazzy. <laughs> um, guess I want a bag room, didn't he? I guess we're gonna have to work on that. That's kind of putting it off. I don't want to get stung. <laughs> Sounds good, Holly. Sounds good. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this because I'm not gonna have that. I'm going to... I don't really want this. I'm gonna keep that, but it might not be in my main room. I guess I'll just put these in here for now. Alright, I wanted that. Um, what else do I have? The soda fountain, the panda, structure manual... I'm just keeping stuff at this point, you guys. You see how easy it is to let your storage get out of hand? It's a legitimate issue. <laughs> yes, Sophia, if you if you check the date here on screen, it's gonna say the 18th. So I did time travel about a week ahead, give or take. Uh, Andrew, I might not fully expand the house. I might not fully expand the house. I might just have like a small cabin. Oh, very nice, Metsuri. Uh, Cole is a really nice villager. Pretty much my thoughts. <laughs> Mage wanted a centipede. I hit the rock all several times to find one. There was more pill bugs than I thought could be. <laughs> okay, gosh. I'm hoping we get the bag worm and, you know, not the uh, things. So you guys were saying I can hit the trees with my net and hopefully a bag worm will pop down? Oh, wait. Oh, okay, I think that might work if it shakes the tree. I have more personality types as well as children for different villagers. I I I agree with the per different personality types. I'm not sure how I feel about them having children, just because I look at the villagers as younger people myself. I guess I don't really know how to explain how I look at these guys. We'll see if this works at least. Uh, Crimson, thank you very much for the biddies. No worries. I know, I know, Red Arrow Mine gets the same way. Exactly the same way. Um, okay, nothing there. 
Oh, that, that's Gaston. <laughs> Gaston, no. Nothing there. I don't know if this is working. Do you guys think this is working? I've never done this before. This feels really weird. I'm so scared of a bee. But I don't want to get rid of in case I need them. <laughs> Oh, Blaze Polly suggested the cafe. Very nice, very nice. Um, no, nothing. Yeah, see, I thought we had to shake the tree, but I don't know if. Yeah, that definitely wasn't working. Okay. This close. I was like a second off. I'm gonna be potato crystal now, you guys. You see what I mean now? <laughs> I did. Okay. It's okay, Padfoot. It's okay. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> oh, I'm beautiful. I need the I need the bag worm first. <laughs> Simply press potato. Uh, I used to play as a kid and I realized like, what money pits that- yes, yes. A lot of apps that cater to children also cater to their parents' credit cards. <laughs> oh, whoops. Oh, my face hurts. <laughs> this is a bad- Bob, this is a bad idea. But it's okay, it's all for Gaston. The things we do for him. I have mainly fruit trees around town, so I have to like pick and choose which trees I'm shaking. Oh, how about this one? No, how about how about this one? No, that's money. This one? No. <laughs> Lucas, hello, how are you doing today? And then you can't see anything? That'd be horrifying. <laughs> Yeah, I'll talk to, I'll talk to her once I'm done shaking trees. And if you guys are just joining us, I'm not doing this because I enjoy being stung. I'm doing this because I'm trying to get a bagworm for Gaston. And they come down from trees. Crystal indirectly finds out her character's horribly allergic. Horribly allergic to bees. <laughs> uh Bracelet Forest, hello. I know, and then I can save and continue, yes. But what fun is that? Oh, I did it too early. <laughs> I will get it one day. One day. Huh? Yeah, Tracy, I just don't want to uh, knock down all my fruit, pretty much. I, I, I don't usually actually pick the fruit for some reason. I usually just uh, leave it and just have it almost as like a decoration, personally. Oh, nothing. Nothing. Rip face times two. At least I couldn't get any worse. <laughs> All you see is the tarantula coming towards me. And the scorpion. In the dead of winter. Because that's a thing. No, I'm joking. I'm, I'm entirely joking. All you hear is the skittering. <laughs> Just the game horribly glitches. We're getting a lot of money, but uh, I'm looking for a bagworm. Uh, realize my date is way off and it says my town start date is the 21st of January. A little annoying, I'm not losing this map and the layout of villagers. I mean, do you guys want to see something really funny? I shared this on the Discord, I think, or on the mod Discord, maybe? I, I showed it somewhere. Um, this 3DS, when I got it, was already pre-set up because the people who installed the capture card had to make sure they worked, right? So, when I got the 3DS, I didn't set my birthday. I didn't set where I was from. Like, all that standard stuff it sets. So, if you guys check out my town pass card... Oh, <gasps> it fixed it! Welcome. Yay! It said I was from somewhere else, and it, it was says, really funny. It said Crystal was from Angola. Angola or something like that. Because that's the first It's the first one. <laughs> in... And that's where it said I was from, and it was really funny. But thankfully it now says Canada. I'm happy. It actually fixed it. I didn't think it would. I thought it was going to be saved in the game. Where do I shake these ones? 
Yeah, I don't remember the exact name of the place. It was just, it was weird, you guys. Oh! Hello. It says you're from Narnia. <laughs> I've got a watering trough from a tree. I got, I got a watering trough from a tree. You heard me, hon. Don't, don't judge me. <laughs> oh, there it is again. Oh, you got it. I got it. See? People are telling me, like, oh, you can't catch them that way. Yes, you can. I'm just bad at it. <laughs> singular bee out of that swarm. I caught the single bee. The others, who knows what happened to them. <laughs> there we go. Not the bee. I wasn't even going for the bees, though. I was going for the, uh... Bagworm, but okay, I gotta be. Move without telling us? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Rosa, we've been streaming for the last hour and it's approximately 30 minutes. I like how some people are like F in chat ahead of time. They like already thought I was gonna get stung. You non believers. <laughs> Okay, we still haven't found a peg for him. Um, I'm pretty sure they're not like a nocturnal sort of thing, are they? They can come out anytime, right? I'm just having horrible. I hear a, I hear a balloon. Oh, that is so annoying. I always believed in you. Thank you. <laughs> uh... Oh no, that's going right over the river. I'm not gonna catch that. Or pop that. That sucks. Oh, whoops. <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm just not finding the bagworm and it's like it's like it doesn't even exist in this town. Okay, there's another item. That's nice. None. Believers, oh my goodness. Oh gosh. <laughs> Maybe try hitting the fruit trees with your net too rather than shaking them? Will that work? I can give it a try. I just don't want to accidentally shake them just because I, I... I like having full fruit trees personally. It's a weird thing, I know, but... I think you can knock the fruit off with your. I don't know. They were seeing if I could knock down the bug, though. I think you. Sounds yeah, familiar. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, so hello, welcome back. How are you doing today? Apparently, I didn't already get these. How do I miss these? A dirty fruit. Uh, it is indeed. <laughs> In the bag, my goodness. Some of these puns, you guys, <laughs> need to rethink your lives for a moment here. I mean that in the best way possible. I'm doing okay, Amazo. I'm doing okay. I'm trying to get something for Gaston at the moment, and it's not happening. I got stung again. Not the bees! It's okay, my face can't get any worse. <laughs> Victor turns around and, like, it's just face horrible. Just <laughs> It's oh, okay. No. I oh, think no. that these sell for a decent amount anyway, from what I vaguely remember, so... Rip face. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, there's another one. Do you see how close I was with that? It doesn't matter, I don't need to catch one ever again, but like... I think we just found all the bees, you guys. Like, literally all the bees in town. But not the bees. Becomes blind. Chuck too many trees. <laughs> Bro. Uh, after seeing it, not after two. Hopefully, yeah. I mean, thankfully. Not hopefully. I mean, obviously I'm seeing it right here. Where are these bagworms, man? I know, so many bees today. Hey, at least I caught one. I caught one. I don't know if we can, like, shake down bugs from fruit trees that way, though. Yeah, I know, Lady Madame, I know. It's kind of funny, though. I, I just let it happen. Let it happen. <laughs> I 
seriously, like... I must have... There's no way I can't have found one by now. I used to find them constantly. Gaston, what do you think about this situation? My face was just sacrificed three times for you. I can't remember if I've done it. I don't think I ever have either, but... I don't know. It's an interesting uh, experiment, nonetheless. Someone's saying shape from behind, so I'll try that. I don't know if it makes much difference. But I might as well. Sophie, I think at this point we're not going to have any more bees. Purely because I shook all them out of the trees for today. I think there's a maximum number. Holly, I'm listening. I would have, like, there's a little, like, noise and a uh, cue that happens when they fall. I don't think I've missed it. I don't know if shaking the same trees again helps either. <laughs> Weird. Anyway, Gaston, I'm sorry. I think you're out of luck, my friend. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and donate this B before I forget. <laughs> B.exe has crashed. Does anyone know if that resets the bees if I save and continue? Because, um, uh, I'd rather not get stung in the face again. Not the face. Not the face. That was really silly. I cannot believe that. <laughs> Is it only between 5 p.m.? I've heard people saying they're all day. Misinformation, you guys. I'm not even sure. It would make a bit more sense if they did. I had a feeling they might have just after the first couple of trees. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I just found all five bees in the town, so... Pretty sure that's the set amount. Okay, there you go. Never again. Not catching one of those. Yeah, I don't know. Either way, it's fine. Gaston can live without his bagworm. We'll, we'll live. He'll be fine, I promise. It is like... I know, I just have the bee word. Bee, bee curse. <laughs> no, no, I wasn't trying to catch bees. I was going for something else. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and sell these. I'm gonna talk to Phoebe, see if she'll fix my face. <laughs> my face. My face. Um, and then I guess we'll work on public works projects, which I need your guys' suggestions, cause, um... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna work on next. I have a lot of options. Okay, so I'm gonna sell these. Cool. <laughs> Michelle a little bit, but there's a lot of things I wonder in Animal Crossing. Like why I can fit a letter, or sorry, a fish into a letter? No. I can fit a refrigerator into a litter, but gosh darn it if I try and put a fish in a letter. <laughs> there's a lot of stuff like that. Ah, monster. <laughs> <laughs> no one asked you. Go away. <laughs> Leave me. Go play Zelda. So mean, you guys. Do you hear this? Was it me that got to you or what? Problem? It's like you don't pay enough attention to what's around you. This town's full of things to get- or out to get you. Be careful. Use this. Thank you. I needed it. <laughs> Her face is better. We're all good to go. So if you talk to her again without using that, would she give you another one? I don't think so. But you could just stockpile that stuff and just do whatever you need to. Oh, gosh. Castle Warrior, hello. How you doing? Like, you go to use it, it's gone bad, and it gets even worse. 
<laughs> okay, guys. Actually, do we have a ceremony to complete right now? We might have the, for the police station. We do. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and do that first. If you guys missed it, we completed the classic police station. We've put it up by our gate to town hall. So if you only if you just like you probably noticed it by now, pretty much. <laughs> Sophia, I used to, but there's a lot of issues with uh, people's internet connections failing and booting everyone out, so for now I'm not. This is so cute. I need to- I should probably take a picture and have this as my, uh... Thumbnail for when, uh, when I upload this stream. On to the next project. There we go. I'll use that one instead of the confetti one. Yeah, cartoon uh, animal gamer. I think it's just Uchi villagers that will do that for you, but it is pretty cool. I know. Why is Kibo all over there? Like everyone is crowded on that one side, and then he's all by himself. <laughs> he's so cute. Buffer is too chubby to reach his other arm. Look at wait or wait. All the, actually, all the penguin villagers technically, um, but Cube here. <laughs> I, I still think he avoid. Um, he he can't reach his his other hand, so I think he's slapping his stomach. That's what it looks like to me, at least. <laughs> Julian, hello. How are you doing today? Oh, Midge, hi. What's up? Um, Crystal, I hope this isn't presumptuous, but I think you could use a ver Vertigo shirt. Um, thanks. I love you, though. Maybe I should- uh, We'll work on Public Works Project first, then we'll do Campsite, then we'll do- Or whichever way, we'll do the police station. Especially Anxious Cube, poor guy. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our list. We have a couple big things to work on and then, you know, the general smaller stuff. Okay, so... For the big ones, we have the Dream Suite and the Museum Renovation. Um, part of me is tempted to do the Dream Suite in a little while, because my town isn't very much to look at right now. Also, guys, please enjoy the magically color-changing question mark. Um, <laughs> um, the museum renovation I want to do primarily because I want to finish it and then have Blathers tell me to do the cafe. That's going to be something I really want. I did, Sophia. I think I haven't for this version, but I, I did do it on my other one. Uh, suit up Gordon? I think it is. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, my town isn't very much to look at yet. Okay, so these are just the big ones. These are just the big ones, right? Then, next up, the other thing that we could work on is, uh, either- these are smaller. Uh, the park clock or the street lamp, because I like having street lamps all over my town. Um, park clock, I just generally have somewhere close to the um, town hall, generally? But yeah. Or there's the campsite. There's the campsite, which that one I'm very tentative on because I still don't know exactly where I want it. But that's pretty much all I want to work on right now. Could put a clock by retail. That would fit. It would fit there. But yeah, I think I want to do one of the smaller ones today and then maybe tomorrow because we'll be able to pay it off in one day, right? Maybe tomorrow work on the... I guess the museum second floor, right? But everyone's saying museum, though. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It, it's gonna take longer. Actually, we already have the bells for the museum, technically, because I, I went to the island last night. Fence. <laughs> I think, you know what? You guys are right. We're gonna do the museum today. I'm gonna finish paying it off today because we already have the bells saved up. And then tomorrow I'll do either the clock or the street lamp. 
Um, and then this way, there's more chance for Blathers to ask us, like, to do the, the cafe. <laughs> so, yes, I think we're gonna do this one. We won't be able to demolish the museum renovation project once it's finished, shall we start? Yes. Pile of pipes! <laughs> Great, maybe we should have the donation gyroid sit inside the train station this time? But anything else? Uh, no thank you. Exactly, Tudor. There's there's a higher chance of getting it sooner. <laughs> no worries, Fireblaze, no worries. We just decided to work on the museum second floor uh, project, which we're gonna pay off immediately because I saved up for it. Cool. Alright, so let's go grab the bells from our bank. I think, was it 198000 Was that how much it was cost? Or how much it costs? <laughs> I think that's how much it was. I'm second guessing myself. And trying to demolish it. I feel like anything that you place in town should be. You can get, demolish it. Anything that's outside of town, like, it doesn't really matter, right? But it's not there. Yeah, Julian, we got very lucky. Uh, Colton suggested very, very quickly. Okay, so I need. There we go. They're scared of Lloyd? He's kind of weird, but he's friendly. How are the trees green? We've uh, time traveled about a week ahead, so they turn green on the 16th, I think, of January. So that's how come they're green. <laughs> And as for, like, how much money we need to donate to whatever or, or uh, spend for upgrades, I honestly don't remember the numbers anymore, I'm sorry. It's been too long. Okay, let's pay this off in one go. Yay! <laughs> It, because it does brand new NPC and yes, I could see that for sure. I wish though, I wish that you could move public works projects once they've been placed. Like, let me pay a fee and I will move stuff. Because that would just be so very useful. Um... I pro should probably sell this shirt that Mitch gave me. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Is that Kevin in here now? Yeah, it is. He finally came back from Main Street. I have so many questions. Personally, I usually do public works projects before house payments, just because I don't really spend very much effort on my house, personally. Um, but if you enjoy interior decorating, then maybe you don't want to do it that way. <laughs> Instead of removing it and re-adding it, exactly. Whew. I think they already have like a teardown fee, don't they? Like if you demolish a public works project, you have to pay? Or am I thinking about changing ordinances? I'm thinking of changing ordinances. Oh, if you want the link to the Discord. There you go. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and scan in our NPC for today. So, as you guys know, um, we already have all ten villagers, so I've started scanning in, um, like, amiable figures. So today, because you guys were talking about him earlier, we're gonna be doing Cyrus. He's not really enjoying the light from behind my camera right now, but you guys will see him soon enough. <laughs> He's pretty cute. I like his amiibo quite a lot, actually. You do have to pay if you remove one? I thought so. I thought so. I wasn't sure, but... Oh, you brought something. Let's have a look then. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. This might be a bad idea. He's still gonna... Okay. 
Okay, so earlier we brought in something for him to refurbish, but now we're taking him away from that? I don't know how this is gonna work. Can we actually do that? Is this gonna work, you guys? <laughs> I've never done this before. Holy snail, that's exactly what I was just saying. That's so weird. Oh, I wonder if he's gonna say no because he's working on something. This is curious. I'm gonna try it. I I might, like, completely ruin the project, but, like... <laughs> Got it. Oh, actually, it looks like the real size is a little busy right now. But don't you worry, I'll do my thing and Cyrus will be here. Okay, so I can have him. This is interesting, so I guess maybe the thing will be finished by tomorrow? I don't think it'll finish by itself. What's this gonna ruin it? This is interesting. I like doing this. <laughs> I like figuring out what I can and can't do. Let's see here. Uh, Tiberian, yes, because I've never actually properly used it before. I've had it in my town, I've only visited like once or twice, so. Altindo, hello, how you doing today? Wisp is gonna be fixing- okay, we need to go see that. Yesterday we saw Wisp sitting in Captain's boat. Today we're gonna see Wisp working on a project. <laughs> Wow, you look so fancy, hon. <laughs> oh, hey, it's done. Can I take it now? Look at- he looks so proud. He finished it all by himself, you guys. That's so funny. Kevin, do you want that? Is that why you're staring at that? I don't think I can resist their capsule toy machine. It's so tempting. What should I do? Go for it, dude. And, uh, Maltendo, thank you very much for that follow. He is adorable, isn't he? Look at him, look at how happy he is. <laughs> Sorry, I was saying, here, squirt. If you need something worked on, come back tomorrow. Can I take this? Because it, it's done. I, that wasn't, was that 30 minutes? When did I put that in? Was that even 30 minutes, you guys? Ark, hello, how are you doing today, dude? Welcome back. I'm so confused by this, but I'm- I'm happy. When did I put that in? That must have been over 30 minutes ago. I probably just lost track of time. That's cool. <laughs> okay. Why don't we go ahead and put this in our house then? Wisp makes the wrong color style. That'd be adorable and you just find him completely messing up. That'd be really, really cute. It doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad. Um, no, I can't take that. And, uh, CJ Monkey, thank you very much for that follow as well. Uh, Pugluxa, we, uh... Finished paying for the museum second floor. We went to the ceremony for the police station. We scanned in Cyrus and we're about to go see him. Pretty much, I think. I think I didn't miss anything, hopefully. Uh, Grace, this is the closest I've gotten, but I couldn't tell Isabel to do it from this side. I had to go over here where there isn't so much of a bend. So I don't know exactly, like, spaces-wise, but I hope that kind of helps. It depends maybe on where you're standing, what side of the river. Oh, CJ, I'm not really giving up my friend code right now. Generally, I just save it for people who I'm doing raffles with or other stuff like that at the moment. Just so that my friends list doesn't fill up too fast again. Crimson, welcome back. Alright, so this is Cyrus's RV. I think it's adorable. Let's go see what Harvey's doing today. We sat down in that chair yesterday. That was weird. Just reading with a burb on his head today. <laughs> Oh, he does have the cabin wall. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I don't need it now. But I want... What is that shirt you're wearing? Oh my god, that is the cutest thing. What else do you got here? Hmm? 
I need that in my life, right? Don't judge me. <laughs> he looks like a shaved alpaca. He kind of does. Finn, I did not. I found them online. Natural. Oh, I like this table. I have. <laughs> I just come in here and I spend money, you guys. This is a dangerous place for me. And that's it. I can't buy that shirt. Give me that. Are you wearing a kilt? What are you wearing on your lower half, sir? Cyrus is a master of breathing new life into tired old furniture, but even he needs a break once in a while, so camping breathes new life into uh, tired old Cyrus. <laughs> yeah, I agree the low table would be good for the cabin theme. What is he wearing? It's cute, but like, what is it? <laughs> I, uh, CC, I agree. I agree. That's one of my favorite things I liked about the Sims 3 is that you could like ref you could change the pattern or design or color of like any item including I think wallpaper and flooring from what I remember. Well at least we got a couple items. It does a little bit arc. It does a little bit. <laughs> it, it does kind of look like kilt or like flannel shorts. I'm not really sure. It's weird though but I guess that's a thing. No one has a shovel, like guess not. Do you guys think we should still look for that bagworm? He really wanted one, but we couldn't find one. I wonder if going on Main Street reset the trees. <laughs> but then again, you guys were saying it's not until like 5 p.m. Maybe? I'm, I'm, I'm still not sure who was right and who was wrong on that one. I don't know if we're gonna be able to find it. Bob, how are you doing today, buddy? It might be cold, but I'm feeling good. You think chowing down some ice cream would, like, freeze my head off? No, it's cool. Ice cream in the winter is good. How are you doing? So, is there something you need from me? Oh yeah, so I heard Bob is gonna be in a step aerobics tournament. Did you know that? I guess he's really into step aerobics and stuff, huh? Maybe you should ask him about it in person. I thought she was gonna say he's moving out, and I'm like, okay, wait, wait, what? <laughs> But not the bees. I see Buddha for sure. I definitely will be. I'm looking forward to doing those again. What a beautiful burp. <laughs> what about you, dude? Just a moment ago, I ran to Pete and got to say hello. That fellow seems kind of careless, but he still does his job really well. I'm sure it doesn't mean that much for him for me, but I think he's actually a pretty good guy. I saw such a sweetheart. <laughs> Is it 5 p.m. to 8 a.m.? I mean, it, I'm so torn on this, you guys. How about you, Midge? Are you feeling better now? She was so angry earlier. <laughs> Just read a book on how to be a better hostess. I think I'd learn more if I actually had someone over. Do you mind coming over to my house so I can practice for a while? Is that right now or is that later? Right now, okay, cool. Uh, Jamin, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. 4 p.m. to 8 a.m. It's all of- okay, How come all of you- How are all of you looking at the wiki? And the times are all different for you guys. How is that a possible thing? Oh my god, Midge. <laughs> oh wait. Your house is this way, isn't it? I was thinking of Blue Bear. I'm sorry, honey. Uh, I think Ark is having bird spasms. Yeah. Yeah, I figured he would be. <laughs> Giant pedal tail, good luck, Dianco, good luck. Okay, let's go to Midge's house here, you guys. Oh, this is my house, let me just unlock the door. In different times between games, it's at 5 to 8 p.m. for safe folk, but it should be for New Leaf as well. I don't know, you guys. Uh, Nimelin, thank you very much for that fall. It's just about to pop up, there it is. Her house is pretty cute. I'd like it better if she had the, the bed. I think there's a pink bed that goes to this set, but it's pretty darn cute. Let's make yourself at home. Will do. I'm just gonna sit here for now and I'll just chat with you guys while I figure out this timing thing. That's really weird. 
I had a bag room is available at a different time. I need to work look for bag work. And I'm crossing the leaf to find the right time. Alright, Platis, that sounds good. Uh Interesting. I'm kidnapping that pink burb, yes, yes. Listen, alright, Ark, the only burb you can actually steal from here is that fire burb because she's caused me so much trouble, you have no idea. <laughs> I know, isn't that a pretty cute house? Like, I'm not really a big fan of overly pink, but her house is pretty cute. I don't want her to ask me to take anything, though. Like, I don't want to buy anything from this house because it's, it's nice. Usually if they ask me to buy, like, a piece of furniture, I'll take the thing that looks the most out of place. <laughs> Andrew, I have already. I know I have. I remember catching it. Oh no. I forgot that this song has that weird, like, backwards Porsche. I don't know what it does. It just doesn't sound right. Do you guys remember that from my bathroom? In my old town? <laughs> like, twirl in the back of her head? I know. I know. She's such a sweetheart, too. I really wish she'd change her shirt, but... Okay, Mitch, I think we're gonna leave before your music does that again. <laughs> Am I hearing that makes all the time I spent cleaning completely worth it? I'm gonna keep doing my best to make or keep my place clean from now on. Okay, so I think what I should do now, maybe, because I asked for you guys' help with this a little while ago. Also, tiny little cat. Thank you very much for the biddies. Um, is we have some pieces of furniture that would go really well for Bob. I think he may already have them, but I still want to get on his good side by sending him stuff. So if you guys have any ideas for letters for Bob, let me know. We have three pieces of paper and... Kitty stereo, kitty bookcase, kitty table, kitty wall clock. I don't know if he has that. I think he has the table. So I'll send him these three. Do you guys have any ideas? Yes, tape it's yes. I wasn't a big fan of that day. Or yay day. I didn't like those days in, in uh, Wild World. Mario Sunshine twinsies. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Let me see here. I'm gonna go up here. You're seeing nothing, Bob. I'm not going to send you anything. I'm not gonna spam your mailbox with letters. Um, okay. Let's see here. Write a letter. To none of you, to Bob. Dear Bob. Nope. How about... Cause I can't think of my own stuff. Is there a space there? No. There doesn't need to be a period at the end of that sentence. It's all good. <laughs> Dear Bob, hi from your BFF Major C. I think I'm called Sweet C in this town right now. Oh gosh. Dear Bob, we worship you. Oh wait, actually that's a good one. No, I keep going for the space bar. We worship you. No, that's not it. Where this one? Simply press chat. There you go. You guys have a letter going to him as well. Last one. Um. What else should we write, you guys? Other favorite villager? I don't have a specific favorite one. Um, I have a couple I like. So I like Eric, I like Goldie. Um, I like Cube and Wade. Uh, 
Uh, Sabuda, I hope so. <laughs> I don't know what else to write. Maybe just uh, I, because earlier, if you guys missed it, we listened on, we listened into a conversation between Bob and Midge, and Midge said that she didn't think he was very mature. So I'm gonna tell him, I think you are very mature. Yes. I do single sentence letters, alright? Judge me. All you want. I'm used to texting. <laughs> okay. I'll go send these off now. I did want to write to Midge. It's okay. I'll, f I'll get another piece of paper. Alright, see you later, Jade. Thank you so much. And take his lotus tea. Okay. <laughs> I also need to save some letters too. I kept forgetting. Um, person in memory. And I'll just send these. Says he's mature, gives him kitty furniture. <laughs> I feel like we're kind of being mean doing that now. Uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and save all these other letters because they're just taking space up in my. Inventory. There we go. Sophisticated gentleman. Was no time for idle chit chat with closed minded burbs. How dare you call her a closed minded burb? She's just mature. <laughs> that kitty furniture, though. <laughs> oh gosh, though. Also, those three are still, like, they're always there on Main Street. Always together. And I'm pretty sure they're plotting a way to move back in. Just saying. <laughs> Alright, though, you guys. I kind of hate to cut the stream short, but I'm still just having a massive headache and it's really annoying. First letter. Hi, Bob. <laughs> um, I will be back tomorrow. Um, Tomorrow... What we're gonna do is we're going to be well first off the museum second floor is done so we can look into that um scanning another villager probably working on more flower stuff hopefully we get some lily hybrids going um and hopefully i can stream for longer tomorrow i hope so um yeah thank you guys so very much for for watching um i'm sorry if you guys just came in and uh and yeah i will see you guys next time